Dear students, this time we are going to talk about reading tips. It's important for you to know that reading is one of the most important skills that English language has. For this, we are going to talk about reading in three stages. Before you read, or pre-reading, reading, and after you read. Before you read, this helps you to familiarize with quickly with the organization and content of written material. You are going to try to find out the most important ideas by reading the titles, headings, subheadings. This also will help you to understand the new vocabulary. It's important for you that, like students of the English major, avoid translation. It's better for you to know the definition of the each word that you find. Reading. For reading, you have two uh, strategies, scanning and skimming. Scanning helps you to find information quickly. You are going to find out keywords and phrases that help you to find the specific information you seek. In this technique, you move your eyes quickly across the words in order to find the information you need. Skimming. Skimming, you read in order to Look for parts of a text that indicate what the authors are talking about, or you are looking for a specific information too. In this case, you are going to look for the topic and the main idea. Uh, the skimming is done in a speed of three to four times faster than normal reading. In this case, you are going to read the title, subtitles, subheading, and illustrations. This technique is very useful to find dates, names, and places. After you read, when you finish your reading, it's important that you have a, you, that you check your comprehension. For this, you are going to find the main ideas. You can find main ideas of the whole reading that commonly you can find on the introduction or a main idea of each paragraph that is in the first sentence of each paragraph. This will help you to recognize topic sentence. Remember that topic sentences are complete sentences that contain the main idea of each paragraph. After you read, you have all other activities like looking for details. This will help you to recognize supporting sentences. For this, you can use specific details such as facts, statistics, examples, or quotations. This will help you to refer important concepts that you have or got from their reading. Also, another activity that helps students to react to the reading is to make inferences or express opinions. This will help students to think critically, to give their opinion and how they feel about what they have read. As I told you, these, these reading tips help you to develop all the activities you have on your assignments for this semester. I hope you have improved a little more of your reading. Thank you so much.